everyone. Uh, my name's Troy. Uh, just had the pleasure of sitting in on AATA's uh, Level 1 and Level 2 UT class. Uh, you know, after getting the training hours, you know, what you're, what you're, what you're going to have to deal with out there in the real world. Uh, no matter what field it may be, paperwork is paramount. If you don't take paperwork seriously uh, on your side or on other people's sides, when you document paperwork, it needs to be in a professional manner with very clear and concise uh, measurements, the, what you are following, your references, the more information the better. When you're out there in the field, take your time. Take your time. There's going to be pressure. There's always going to be time pressure to get it done and get it done fast. They want you to be on the ship or in the plant for as short a time as possible so that they can get continue with whatever they're doing. There will be eyes on you. You're going to have to explain to them, a, you know, in a professional manner, you know, that this is going to take time. I'm going to take my time, but you will see me here the entire time. I'm not going to be slacking. If you let that pressure get to you, you could obviously miss things. The only thing I cared about was not killing people. If you miss something crucial at a nuclear plant, people are going to die. I am willing to be fired or laid off if it, if it is at the expense of my ethics. You can't be afraid of losing your job to do the right thing. You need to be very humble and willing to ask for help and, and ask for a second opinion. Three main scenarios, I think, where you may miss something or may pick up something that actually isn't there. Option A is it's the equipment. My experience, the cable usually fails first. That's usually your weakest link in your equipment. It can be you. What am I doing? You know? Because there's a lot of human error in this too. A lot of interpretation and it's a lot of just knowing what you're doing. And number three is it could be the material itself. You know, like something geometrically goofy going on that you don't know about. Get really familiar with your equipment and this just comes with experience. Before you know it, you are that second opinion because here comes somebody else that has less experience than you. It's a, it's a double-edged sword. You have to be confident in what you're doing, but you also have to question yourself. Complacency kills. It's kind of a conundrum. You have to be confident, but you have to you have to doubt yourself as well. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's, 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 it's weird.